thousands of dollars are now being offered as a reward as police try to catch the crooks behind a string of robberies we first started telling you about on Wednesday. Good evening, I'm Neil Watson. This is video from the aftermath of a robbery at a liquor store in La Mesa. And this is what it looked like after a after a gas station convenience store in the Stockton neighborhood was targeted. ABC 10 News reporter Natalie Chuck joins us live outside a third victim. Natalie, these crimes have a lot in common. Hey there, Nia. Yeah, Tradewinds Liquor Store here in Oak Park is one of the most recent in a series of more than a dozen robberies all throughout San Diego County. Police say five people walked into this store and they went right up to the register, took out cash and stole alcohol. Now, the details in this robbery sound eerily similar to one up in North County that was captured on video that you're about to see. It looks like a typical trip to the gas station, but in a matter of seconds, three people rip out cash registers and run off. In the video given to ABC 10 News, you can hear the clerk say, this is what investigators say at least 13 convenience stores throughout the county have experienced. A group of young men brandish firearms at the clerk while demanding money and products. In some of the cases, cash drawers and registers have been taken. What was your reaction seeing that surveillance video of the robbery? It was horrifying. Arkan Somo is the president of the Neighborhood Market Association. It's a nonprofit advocating for family owned businesses. Now it's offering a $10,000 reward for any information leading to an arrest in these robberies. We are very confident that that reward will help our law enforcement to get that extra you know, that extra edge, if you will. These people hit you at the last possible moment. They, they are your store. Louis Jabaro owns a store just across the street from one of the liquor stores that was robbed. In his opinion, robberies are just part of owning a business. He's been a victim in the past. We know it's going to happen. We just don't know when it's going to happen. But a bold spree like this one is unnerving. I am not happy about it. I hope they get caught. And we're not going to stop. We are really not going to stop until we get these criminals. Now, we are expecting the Neighborhood Market Association and other county investigators to reveal more information at a press conference coming up on Monday afternoon. In the meantime, if you have any information that could help them figure out who is behind these robberies, please contact Crime Stoppers. For now, reporting in Oak Park, Natalie Chuck, ABC 10 News.